Ah, uh, yes, back to Bee Island, where we're gonna snipe some bad creatures out of space with our ballistas. Woo. Also, I still don't understand how bees have understood how to make rocket technology, but they definitely have, and I'm all about it. Speaking of which, it's time to upgrade our minigun. And look at these guys over here. These are the medic bees. They're like, oh, you're injured. Let's give you some giant red cross things, which I thought was against like the Geneva Convention or something. But let's order a few more of those bees up. We need some more soldiers. And you know what? Let's get like two more medical bees. We still can afford like 181 bees. So I'm just going to keep spamming until we get an entire boatload of soldier bees here. Uh oh, your majesty, I report our scouts have noticed that hornets have tempted to team up with moths. According to our data, the moths are going to be target our buildings, large and tenacious. And we don't know what they do to hive. I wonder if they're gonna be like stealth bombers. And if so, it's time to really get militarized. And while I'm militarizing, I'd like to thank the Ridge for sponsoring this video. So Ridge has fired up their summer sweepstakes and they're giving away this brand new Hennessy Ford Bronco for $75,000 if you prefer. And the best part is you can enter to win without spending a dollar by visiting their website. And you guys know that I've been using my Ridge wallet for three years now and I love it. And if you've been looking to get one of these sleek low profile wallets, now's your best time time to pick one up because you get a bonus entry for every dollar you spend on the site and the custom Hennessy products also come with up to a thousand free entries for your chance to win that Bronco. Now the Ridge has over 3 million customers and 50,000 five star reviews. The Ridge team is so confident that you'll like their products that they'll let you test drive them for 99 days and you can send it back for a full refund if you don't love it. The durable material also means that the products come with a lifetime warranty. So like I said, if you've been on the fence about wanting to get a Ridge wallet, now is the best time for you to buy one. You can use my link down below in the video description, you'll get 10 bonus entries on checkout. And that link is ridge.com slash blitz and use the promo code blitz for 10% out on checkout. Remember, R-I-D-G-E dot com slash B-L-I-T-Z. Let's get that minigun up. How much farther the minigun? Minigun, how much farther till you're done? 50 seconds. 50 seconds. Okay, I don't know how big that's going to be, but we are just going to start adding a bunch of honeycombs. And then hopefully our lazy little worker bees are going to go over there. Let's also build up this area. And they're not lazy. They're busy as a bee. Also, bee jokes are sweet. I thought about just like going to Google and be like, okay, Google, give me a list of 14 bee puns. And then it was just going to tell me all the bee puns in the world. Oh, but now the minigun is ready and we can get an anti-aircraft system. <laughs> Unlocks new weapons. Oh boy. Auto-guided missiles. <gasps> and a sting. Oh boy. <laughs> this is going to be good. All right. Let's get ourselves some weapons. The minigun. Oh, it's not very big. It also takes two of these. So we should be fine. The hardened wax. I like how there's a bunch of shell casings and stuff down here. And I'm hoping these will be built up pretty quickly. It looks like all of the resources are here. Oh, wow, that one's actually going up. All right, minigun. This is going to be good. All right, little minigun. Oh, ho, 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 ho. the moths have no chance to survive. Also, I totally forgot how to leave that. I guess escape works. Cool. Should I build another minigun? I kind of want to, but I think I should build some over here. And I want to make sure we have enough hardened wax to build into this way. Last thing I want to do is be empty of hardened wax. There's not much there, is there? But we do have all four of our miniguns created. We have a minute and 15 left. Did I start? Yes, the anti-aircraft system's going up. So let's build up a little area here for that. How many soldiers did we produce? Actually, quite a few. Let's get a bunch more of them. And I think the soldiers took hardened wax. No, they take uh, the green and the white. What's the white? Pollen or something? Oh, nice. Radar. Okay, track hornets, shoot ahead, or bulletproof vest. Let's try, hmm, I don't know. I'm gonna say the radar, but that takes more hardened wax, which we don't have. And we should be able to build now the surface to air missiles. We just straight up went militarized mode here. How expensive are you? Oh, wow, it's actually the same as the minigun. <laughs> and do we have enough wax for that? Cause that'd be awesome if we did. And what does this mean? Uh-oh, we're not the only ones tired of this prolonged war. I'm sure if we distribute propaganda posters, some hornets will join our side. Nice, I heard a horn. Oh boy, there's the minigun. Whoa! Okay, the moths are stealth bombers, but my miniguns are insane. Oh, here we go. We got the SAM sites too. Guided missiles. <laughs> oh, this is incredible. All right. All right. Things are working really well in our future. Where is... Those aren't the guided missiles. Oh, they are. This one. Nice. All right. I want, I want to play with it. Why can't I click it? I can't use the guided missiles? Oh, it's the worst day ever. It's okay. Nothing had... 
nothing is getting close to surviving. <laughs> Wave 13. Look at that range. Oh, I can't even see up that high. <laughs> Okay, we devastated the enemies. That's fantastic. Let's get some more of this. Oh, the radar is going. And now Sting? Are these, oh, supersonic projectiles? My goodness. The Howitzer Sting 1. Hmm. Launches an explosive projectile. Massive area damage. Okay. I don't know if I want those, but let's get uh, some of the academic and decon. And we can get our wax production increase too. I have an idea that we can completely surround our entire base with those SAM missiles. The bees are making it work. Ooh. Build a maximum number of honeycombs. Oh no, I didn't know that was a thing. So I guess that means we have to remove some of them. All right, what's the worst of the worst? Can I actually remove? Is there a removey button? Yeah. All right. I'm so sorry, Ballista, you served your country well. Sorry, not sorry. You guys are going away. Okay, let's put in another surface air missile. I didn't realize we were going to run out. I was going to make a giant hexagon-shaped base here and then destroy everything with it. It would have been funny, I promise. Okay, we got to waste some wax. We don't need things over here. I want them over here instead. And the real question is, how fast is our wax being produced? Seems like we have some pretty decent storage. I kind of maybe want one more hard wax factory. And we'll put in some more hard wax storage. No, I want the big ones, not the little ones, whatever. That way we can save space on some of these things. Like I can delete these pollen ones or nectar storage and I can make it somewhere else. And then I can use that for more surface air missiles. Also, I feel like this area might be good. Let's get rid of this gun because it sucks. We'll get rid of it after the next wave. Actually, I'll just put in another Sam over here. Yeah, and another Sam right here. And then we'll put in the wax factory right here. Nice. <laughs> we can recruit more wasps to our team. Where are they going to come from? There they are. <laughs> Hello, little wasps. Have you come to fight the evil moth people? So have I, because I have surface air missiles now and miniguns. Okay, so these are pretty well defended. We have one here, one here. I kind of just want to make an entire wall of them. How much fun would that be? I'm so excited. I just, I really can't hide it right now. Also, I need to check on the research. We are, okay, we got this one done. Ooh, carbon bucket? I don't care about that. We have moths to attack. Oh, I hear things. Okay, we have firing. There they go. Wow, at that long range. My goodness. Okay, I think these SAM missiles are way the best thing in the game. Wait, we already defeated the wave? That was nothing. Okay, fine. Let's get um, increased live in peace. More and more hap. Now 10 hornets will switch sides. Yeah. Fierce kneading. Oh, ambrosia production increase. I kind of want more missiles though. Let's go with the improved medicine first because I have all of those resources and I'm not stopping. I am not stopping with the sand missiles. We're going to build all of those up. We're going to remove these out like so. Mainly so we can afford to build more cool things like fountains. Woo. I'll make some double-decker ambrosia storage because I have some over here, of course. Your double-decker honey storage as well because we have a lot of honey storage and there's some like wax storage too. Kind of just want to remove all of the single things like that, but meh. Okay, that is significantly faster. The improved medicine, so we'll be able to heal everything faster. And then we're going to take bulletproof vest. Ooh, legendary commander. Defensive bees damage increased by 100%. Bulletproof vest is next. Not too expensive, my goodness. That line is deadly. Okay, this area was an entire waste. I'm trying to find like any more little areas that I just don't need. Anywhere else, there's a few more. I mean, I could give it more nectar storage. Then I could remove like two of the regular ones. I kind of wish you could upgrade rather than just like, here, have a new one. Because now I can just get rid of two of these pollen storages because I put a new one on top of it. But I don't want to get rid of pollen because it might be attached to something else. So why did I why did I do that? I should just delete these. There we go. Oh, and there's the limit. So I can make, what, 60, 64, 62 more? I can also make a ton more bees. Let's do it. I'm just going to queue this up forever. Make the queen do her work. Let's make 50 of these bees. That's still going to be way short to the limit, too. Where's our kindergartens at? Our kindergartens, we can make builder bees. We don't need any more of those, though. We can make more soldiers. I don't know. I'll make 10 soldiers at each one. Even though we're making, like, way better soldiers over here. It's okay. I just want a huge defense. Nice, and this is ready. So let's live in peace. We're going to summon more of these. Royal mercenaries, too. Shoot, I didn't want that. I wanted this one. Oh, well. I'm building two more sites here to put up more missiles. I 
don't know if I need them. I feel like over here I could use another one too. Now the question is, do I actually want the surface air missiles in all of these locations? I think yes. Although we are going to make the other one soon, the Sting, and then these ones too. Cool, and we'll be able to summon more wasps in a second. All right, let's speed this up until the next attack. And here they come. All right, we got another wasp bomber, in, or a moth bomber. <laughs> Go missiles! My goodness. <laughs> Shooting them all down. That is so stinking cool. Oh, I love that. All the moths are dying. All of the dragonflies are dead. Woo! Good. Uh oh, more dragonflies. All oh, those ones are bombing us. They actually shot a little bit at us. That is illegal. All right. So they did damage. They took out some of our storage. What? Those didn't. Uh oh. Oh my goodness. All right. So we definitely need more defense. And I wonder if this breaks, what would happen? I don't like that. Let's quickly put something like this in. So they're just connected at a different spot. And now I'm gonna give the sting. We need stinger missiles. Ooh. Wow, check that out. That's uh, six hardened wax. Thankfully, I think I have plenty of it. We did lose two of these. And I think we lost an ambrosia or two. Let's do this. And as soon as that's created, I'm gonna make ambrosia and then delete two of the others. And maybe not. I don't care. What I care about is getting my stingers up and then we're gonna upgrade to the supersonic projectiles too. All right. Ooh, a choice. Uh-oh, I don't know what that means. I'm a little bit scared. But now I can make the sting, so that's cool. Now, what is the sting? Oh my goodness, it's a giant cannon. All right, uh, I need to upgrade that a little bit more. Does that look right? I feel like it's derpy. Is that better? Maybe. I mean the sting. All right, sting, you're stupid expensive. Build yourself. I love the little beak-shaped crane, too. We are gonna start removing some of these other guns because I, I have always thought they're bad. They might not be, but I think they are. So if I think they are, then they are. Because I'm the queen of this beehive or something. Goodbye, howitzer. Goodbye, that thing. Let's recreate you as missiles. Man, this thing built fast too. And this thing is working in seven seconds. Good, because two minutes till the next wave. Let's get another surface air missile in here. And where did I take these other two out? One's right there and one's right here. They're almost built. Okay, pop that one in. I really wish I would have paid better attention to making my base look nice rather than just slapping things literally everywhere. Oh, it's ready. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay, that's that's really cool. All right, good job, Sting. Proud of you. And not just the blade from Lord of the Rings. Okay, those are both went up. Did I miss another one anywhere? Yes, one right there. I also didn't recognize that Sting was literally another weapon. But now we have supersonic projectiles, legendary commander, defensive bees. What is field talks to? Show ourselves to worthy opponents. A new button appears at the top left when you click, which half the enemies decide to leave the battlefield. Wow. <laughs> we give you the choice to surrender, nerds. And we straight up kill them anyway. And eat, eat them. I also feel bad for this because this thing's like really outdated. I could nuke those. But the thing is, like, I'm not going to be able to build anything else in there anyway. I might as well just leave them up. I could upgrade them to rockets, I guess. I should get rid of this one. But I have 12 seconds. Okay, hopefully this is an easy wave. And hopefully Sting gets a few dozen kills. All right. It just fired. All of that went. We have moths coming in. Moth went down. The other moth is going down. I saw a minigun fire. Good job, miniguns. All right, it's working. It's working. Look at all of our bees, though. Wow. Okay, our soldier bees can't even do anything. I have a feeling they will have to work in the future. Yeah, because this is this is painful right here. They all just went to the same bee, and I totally just something happened. I'm not sure what it was, but the whole game froze up. Oh, we're back. Okay. We're good. That was a little bit tense. There were way more than I figured there were. So let's try to get some mercenaries. We definitely need more surface to air missiles. I can do what? I've got 29 left and each of these takes what, two, four, seven. So I can do three more pods. Where's the best space for it? I could also purge you and you, but I need to attach you somewhere else. Let's do this. So I feel like if I break that, all of these will fall off and I don't want that to happen. Although you can fall off and so can you and you 
and you, and you, and I could drop that one, but I'm scared of that side. So let's get another one here. I'm gonna put another one here. If these dinguses will ever build that one, I'll put one here. We have another ballista that we don't need, so we're gonna remove that one. I'm gonna plop another one in here. Okay, where is the weak spot now? I've got a bunch of SAM missiles everywhere. I guess that's weak. I don't want that thing. I actually kind of feel like the miniguns are important too, because they're really good at individual targets. So I'm gonna remove this guy and then replace that with a minigun because we already have a couple SAM turrets here anyway. How many can I afford? Uh, 61 more, so that's fine. I've been doing good. I've been getting rid of the things we don't need and replacing it with the good things we do need, like these. We don't need these. Okay, another SAM turret here. We'll do a minigun. Right here, I said. Come on, hurry up, little bees. We're gonna be right in two minutes. I guess we can get rid of this one as well. And I should replace the individual guys, like these ones, with the better ones, right? I mean, I don't know if those little rocket launchers are actually good for anything, but I mean, they gotta be better. Where are, what are they? Yeah, regular rocket launchers. Okay, if I see an open hole, like it's a rocket launcher. Woo! Would you like my song? Just made it up. So I think it's about, yeah, 25 of the soldiers bees have been created. We are, we have a lot of bees now. Like there's a ton of them flying around. Okay, you are ready. Oh, where are you firing first? <laughs> oh man, <laughs> he shot directly at, oh, there's two moths now. Why do the moths have to be stealth? Oh, wow. And it, it this is good. This is good. This is really good. I mean, for us, oh my word. That took like eight shots. All right, well defended. I definitely don't want a moth to come close to me because they look like a stealth bomber, but they are. <laughs> That's so cool. They're not very stealthy though. We have better radar than the Hornet clan will ever be. Good. I just got some more agitation in. Oh, the wasps aren't even doing anything. They're like, yeah, we'll just join the party. My defense is way too good for them. Yes. That was great. Okay, I'm happy about that. I was concerned about these waves, but now I'm not. So we're just gonna blitz through the research, place down a few more SAM sites. I've got 30 left, so I can do like four more. One, and then we'll do number two, number three, number four, number five. They all got done building that one. How many more? I've got nine more spaces left in my hive. You know, I could remove things like this, I don't even know what it does, but it builds me builder bees and I'm not even using builder bees. So if this wave gets interesting, then we might. And I don't see any more old tech. I think I've upgraded everything. I guess there's one. That probably is not even gonna fire. My goodness, all of those missiles going. They're taking a few things out and then they redistribute if they destroy something. That's incredible. All right, all right, bad, bad moth bombers. Ooh, that one actually got close. Now we're getting some AAA or some minigun firing. No, no miniguns. Oh yeah, there are. All right, good news, miniguns are firing. So if things get, oh, that one actually hit our base. That's illegal. And that one tried bombing. Oh, the moth bomber almost got here too. All right, <laughs> that was awesome. This game, there's something crazy about it. <laughs> we got a flame, we got a flame boss. Look at all the, the bullets down there too. Hurry up research, we need to complete you. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. I gotta connect you, and then I'm gonna delete you. Goodbye, builder bees. I just wanted a big fountain, that's all I wanted. <laughs> it's gonna be delicious. Okay, then synthetic materials. I don't even know why I need that, but this sounds cool. I'm gonna get fierce needing so I get more stuff, and now let's get the fountain up. If I were a big fountain, where would I be? Oh, that's small. I thought it would be huge. The good news is it did free up enough real estate for me to build two more big missiles though. Give me that sweet park, that big fountain. That's what we needed to celebrate our air superiority. Uh-oh, miniguns. I don't like being in fast forward mode in the middle of a battle. <laughs> the moths are going down. Oh, here we go. Hey, some of you guys just turn around and head home. It'll be fun, I promise. And then let's uh, just get a few more troops to our side. Here they come. There's reinforcements. Hi, wasp friends. Uh oh, oh, the the bomber's coming in. Um, are they dying? Wow. Oh, they're actually attacking me. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. The moth bombers actually made it. Oh dang, our bees did nothing either, and we got shredded. Ooh. 
Oh, gross. Oh, big gross. All right. Um, here, choice. Ooh, peaceful ending. Upgrades unlocked. I want military ending. Ah. <laughs> Boom. Did I create a nuke? I created a nuke, didn't I? That's a nuke. It is. <laughs> We're gonna make a nuke. Uh huh. We're just gonna blow up everything? Honey is not waiting. B Island. All right. <laughs> or its time is up. What an interesting game. So much fun. You have earned protected the queen. The high will prosper, even though the moth bombers got us in the end. Anyway, my friends, that'll do it for today's video. So keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. I'd like to thank all my patrons and channel members, including Auto Dave, Ben, Dickie J, Teddy Hippius, Injor, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Ritla Warrior, Keegan H, Zarnoff, Maxer, Ral, AC Engineer, Cigars Morex, Spencer T, Whiskey, Endless Games, Splatters X, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brad Dalton C, Scatterdy, Grayson, Elvora, Zane W, Kyle V, Mr. Triple One, Peyton Place, Fussy Badge, Missing Sniper, Nolan, Kyler J, Pink Tiger, Jaden A, Mirage, and Nitrox.